Hey everybody, I'm Gabby and this is RVs with Gabby. If you are into camping and traveling, if you love RV life too, RVs with Gabby is the right channel for you. RVs with Gabby at gmail.com Hey everybody, welcome back to another episode of RVs with Gabby. Thank you so much for watching my channel. If you love my videos, don't forget to hit the like button down below and hit subscribe so you never miss another walk around video. All right, we have Hershey PA show coming in two weeks, count them two. We're gonna be there from Wednesday the 14th to Sunday the 19th. It'll be in Hershey, Pennsylvania. And I'm gonna be there in the Integra display. So I'm taking the next couple weeks leading up to the show to go over some of the Integra models and floor plans that you might see at the show. And we can get you a really good deal at that show. So please come out and see me, ask for Gabby in the Integra display. I would love to get you in your next coach. All right, today we're taking a look at the new 2023 Integra Vision XL 34G. This is a big mama. You are looking at 37 foot in length. You've got the new V8 with 350, horsepower and 460 foot-pounds of torque you can pull up to 5,000 pounds and beautiful gorgeous 120 inch windshield as we always like to talk about this is built with turkish sand so it's got a very very smooth defined look to it the curve runs over the side of your pillar here your pillar is much smaller on the integra so you're going to get a lot more of that gorgeous beautiful like mountain views when you're out west if you're out going out to tennessee or going out even further to colorado just a gorgeous front end you have a one-piece molded fiberglass front cap that reaches up and touches your one-piece molded fiberglass roof just super high end on these integras they do not spare any expense Ooh, what is that bug you've got chrome mirrors here with the side view cameras up there these are heated and electric that bug is really really loving me today <laughs> um coming down the coach you have your easy drive elite package i've talked about this a couple times it is going to be very similar to your j-ride or your j-ride plus on the jayco side of things but this is the um meat and potatoes of your unit okay every other unit on the market is going to have a similar floor plan maybe but they will not have that windshield they will not have our warranty and they will not have this easy drive elite and let me tell you for 23 they have beefed it up even more so you have a computer balanced drive shaft that helps reduce the the noise and the movement on the steering wheel when you're driving down the road you have got upgraded front and rear heavy duty stabilizer bars. Those are gonna be two inch thick each, which is really gonna help with that sway control, guys. This is a very tall unit. You've got jounce bumpers, or uh, some people call them sumo springs. So that's in the front and the back for a better ride. You've got your upgraded Coney shocks. Don't forget guys, Coney shocks are those um, twin tube shocks that you'll find on Lamborghinis and Ferraris. Why wouldn't you want those on your motorhome, right? And now new for 23, I'm super excited to announce that they've also added a Helwig helper, uh, Helwig stabilizing bar, sta uh, Helwig steering stabilizer. That's the word I was looking for. So now it's gonna be a smoother, you're gonna have a smoother turn. You're not gonna have as much, um, it, you know, there's a lot less, a little more rigidity with the steering wheel. So you're gonna have just a better handle on your coach overall. So you, you asked for it and we gave it to you, which I love that Integra did that for the customers. Um, lastly, but not least, you're also going to have 22 inch Michelin tires. So the nice, big, beefy tires, you're just going to hug that road super smooth. And just overall, it will drive not like a bread, bread box, but more like a Mercedes. So that is the, um, easy drive elite package moving down the coach, right? You've got your two year interior warranty from Jake, uh, from Integra, excuse me, and three year exterior structural warranty, right? That's number one in the in industry. Most other brands are going to give you one year of the limited on the, on the interior build and Integra gives you two. That's why they're big and number one in the business, right? Coming down the side of the coach, you've got a full wall slide on this camping side. What I love about that is they have put the awning on the slide out. So you don't lose the first two feet of awning you know, over that slide out. You still get a nice big eight foot awning. You guys can hang out and camp here. Tons of storage on this, guys. You've got the upgraded metal slam latches, right? And then in here, you've got one rotocast bay. It's got a little bit of cover on the top. Two, and this is gonna be full pass through. That's about a 14 inch of clearance. So your chairs, your fishing poles. I'm not sure if a kayak would fit in here. I guess it depends if it's a folding kayak. And then 
another storage bay here. So I love the storage on this unit. If you are looking for a unit that can sleep the whole family and you can carry all the gear, the 34G is definitely it. Entertainment center outside with your smart TV and your radio with outside speakers, Bluetooth, whatever you want to listen to, it'll be there. And you're underneath your nice awning, right? Coming down the side of the coach here, propane bay is here. You've also got your ba house batteries on a nice slide out tray. So that's super convenient. They slide right out there. You don't have to duck in that um, storage bay too much. And there's gonna be a quick connect here for your grill. So even though you don't have an outside kitchen, um, you have that quick connect to your propane tank. You can bring along your grill in that big storage bay and you'll be able to cook outside here. Finally, going down the end of the coach, you've got one more full pass-through storage there. Super awesome. Oh, and also new for 23, you've got a solar panel and solar controller. I believe it's a 190 watt solar panel. So super, again, another feature customers were asking for and they gave it to us. One more last little storage bay, a little bit smaller. Maybe you could put your tools and things in that. And then coming around the back end of the unit, you've got a ladder to get you up there to that one piece molded fiberglass roof. Now you have slide toppers standard, as you can see above your slide outs, that's gonna protect you from leaves, branches, things like that. Um, big feature is gonna be towing, towability on this. You have a 5,000 pound hitch rating, or, or I'm sorry, 5,000 pound tow rating and a true 500 pound tongue. You do need about 10% of that total trailer weight to be able to pull it. So some units will say something like, 8,000 pound tow and then a 500 pound tongue rating. So truly this can pull 5,000 pounds. So you got a smaller car, you wanna bring your Fiat, your smart car, your golf cart, all you can load it up on the back of the unit. Around the back here you have your um, other side of the pass-through storage but that's where your 50 amp port is. So you've got that little, um, little door that you can open up and get it out this way so you don't have to leave this storage bay door open. One thing I will point out, these are metal slam latches so um, some people will have the slam latches and then this is going to be plastic and that's just going to rip off guys so they make sure they do the metal slam latch baggage doors fuel fill is going to be on the driver's side towards the rear of the coach so pretty good um pretty good on that layout and then you've got your um tank drain here i love this because it's up high out of the way right you've got a door for access but that pvc pipe is not dragging on the ground and possibly ripping things off so like that, the height on that is really good. Water tanks here, or controls for your water tank. So um, if you're like me and you love camping, but you're not very smart, <laughs> I said that wrong, I am very smart. I just, I'm not schooled on this kind of stuff here. This makes it super easy for anyone to figure out how to fill your tanks. It's all color coded. Now keep in mind, if you purchase with RV1, you will get not only a walk around class with a demo tech who knows what they're talking about to help you learn this stuff, guys, but you'll also get one year of our unlimited roadside assistance program and your uh, one year of technical assistance. And that is a hotline you can call 24 seven to talk to a certified RV technician to walk you through anything you need help with on your coach. Um, sometimes it's hard to get a hold of those service uh, you know our service techs are super busy and sometimes it's hard to get a hold of one or two of them so super convenient to have that that comes with every purchase from RV retailer doesn't matter if it's new or used product you get a VIP uh, one year roadside and technical membership you also get 14 days free of camping with thousand trails super nice too all right you've got a 5500 Onan Cummins generator that's a gas generator it's gonna run off the same ta tank as your gas tank for those customers wondering, um, it will shut off at a quarter tank to prevent you from running out of gas when you're on the road. So if you wanna run the ACs in the back for the kids or the rest of the family and you're driving and it starts to get to a quarter tank, it will automatically shut that off to make sure that you're not stranded somewhere. Okay, let's head on inside and check out the inside of the coach. Two steps here, guys, big deal. Some other brands will have one step. I will also point out that your, um, Cargo carrying capacity is massive. You're at 3,300 pounds. You could put a small car on the roof of this RV and you'd probably still be able to put stuff in it. I know a lot of other brands out there, you look at the payload for the chassis and things and you're like 500, 800 pounds of stuff. Huge on the 34G, 3,300 pounds of cargo capacity. How's that, Caleb, with the AC on? Is it much better? <laughs> 
So today I actually prepared us and we were able to cool the unit down ahead of time. A lot of times I last minute say, let's go shoot a video and it's 90 degrees outside here in Orlando right now. Um, if you haven't watched my videos before, I am located in Castleberry, Florida off of 436 outside of Orlando. You know, if you're out of state, we do sell out of state as well. Come on down and visit Mickey Mouse and then come see us and bring your new coach home with your kids, right? Okay, <clears throat> we'll start up front actually. I was just raising that for later. 34G, <clears throat> you have your uh, auto leveling system on the left there next to the driver. Now for the new 22 um, <clears throat> chassis here, you've got a tilting, uh, tilting steering column. So you can actually adjust that steering wheel as well. So previously for the old V10 models, you did not have that. So that's a huge feature. Um, you can adjust it more if you're shorter or you're taller. You can move that steering column for a little more comfort of a ride. Uh, seats are very comfortable. They do turn around. You have a table that'll go here with a couple of cup holders. What I love about this is on the um, 34G, both your driver and your passenger have power seats. So that was something they were missing for during the pandemic. We were really short on those and a lot of people went without um, and they had manual seats and you could just feel the difference guys, especially if you're sh shorter like me, uh, that power driver seat is going to be huge because it really brings you up forward towards that uh, steering pedal. Okay. Little tabletop here for anybody who wants to um, navigate or, you know, maybe you have your laptop and you want to work while driving. You've got a nice little Sony uh, digital dash here. This is going to display your radio, your uh, Bluetooth, your phone, and then you've got your camera controls, which it won't show up right now because the coach is not on, but that is also where your left and right blinker will show down the side of your coach so that you know what's coming up in your blind spots. Um, huge bed on this one um over the competition a lot of brands are doing like a 300 400 pound bunk capacity on this baby here let me um let's pause it a second i'm going to adjust the bed to show them ta-da we got it down you just have to bring those chairs back a little bit and i didn't want you to sit through watching me fumble with those um okay big bed up here almost like a king size bed it is a 750 pound bunk rating and i love this euro lift system a super strong sturdy bunk we don't have a lot of issues with these bunks tilting and stuff because it's not that smaller Schwintech um, motor system up here you'll see you have like a European lat style um, bed so it is very comfortable it's not just a piece of plywood for the guests your table is underneath there and then also you do have these little protective um, barriers that are going to sit on the edge so that the kids don't roll out of bed in the middle of the night on the right side next to Caleb there, you have a full tri-fold pull-out sofa. And above it is going to be your large, uh, I think it's a 50-inch TV, smart TV. And uh, lots of storage throughout. I love that they put any storage cabinet they can up there, up above the door even, which I don't know how I'm going to reach that, but it's fine. And over here across from your tri-fold sofa and your big TV, you're going to have these two electric recliners. Love that. Um, now, big thing with Integra is their safety focus. So you can see that every single seat, seating location has seat belts and they are bolted to the frame properly. They are safety rated. So you can comfortably sleep um, eight people and you can also seat those eight people with seat belts. You have two seat belts in the couch, two seat belts in the theater seats. Um, and actually, I think there's, is there two or four seat belts in here? You have plenty of seat belts is all I'm going to say. And now they have... They even have car seat tethers. So if you have little ones with car seats, they added that feature as well. Another thing customers were asking for and they, and they listened and they answered. Um, solid surface counters, not only in the kitchen, but also on the dinette. I love that it's not a press, nice solid table. You have cup holders here to prevent spillage when you're playing your card game as dad's driving down the road. And then this is a dream dinette. So legless, super comfortable, and it just lifts right off the wall and you drop it down to make a bed so you've got two people on the overhead bunk you've got two on the trifold so uh trifold pull-out sofa and then you've got another two on the dinette now this is a little bit shorter so maybe your younger kids or people like me vertically challenged will sleep there <laughs> and now we're going to move into the kitchen i love this kitchen it's in the modern farmhouse interior right stacy stewart came out with it in 2019 it's been a huge success um, so you have all these cabinets overhead nice big residential size high point microwave um, you have a little oven down here as well as your three burner propane cooktop 
solid surface counter, right? Also solid surface for the sink cover, which is really nice. Nice deep stainless steel sink here. This pink fluid, guys, is uh, just winterization fluid from the factory. A lot of customers come in and they're like, oh, a little kid spilled soda. Nope, it's just winterization from the factory. They all come from Indiana and they never know where they're going. All right, big feature everybody loves is this beautiful barn door on your bathroom. Directly across from the barn door to the bathroom is going to be your residential refrigerator. This is a General Electric fridge. Um, the models may vary depending on what they had in stock at the time of shipment, but it's always going to have the ice maker and the water filter um, on the unit's door. Now this is really hooked up by Jayco. You can use it. You will get ice and you will get water. Um, make sure you ask ma other manufacturers if they are hooking up their fridge. Uh, for you to use or if they're expecting you to hook it up yourself because some people install them and never hook it up so you actually can't use it on other products but Integra make sure you are lined up with that already done. Walking into the bathroom here you've got a nice porcelain foot flush toilet plenty of as Matt likes to say prime poop in position <laughs> space here for your legs. Um, another solid surface counter in the bathroom. This is big guys. A lot of people will cheapen it up and put a press countertop in the bathroom and just do the solid surfaces out there. So a uh, nice big mirrors and medicine cabinet. You've got a towel rack behind me, another little hand towel rack here to the left. And then your shower is going to be a pretty nice shower fixture. I wish the head was a little bit bigger, but it is nice. It's black. Um, it's not that cheap plastic, um, you know, with the uh, twist, the left and the right hot and cold twist ties. Um, up top, you've got a skylight, pretty big, deep shower. I think somebody pretty tall can fit in there, so that is awesome. Step in, um, sorry, Caleb, we'll have to do the. You've got washer dryer combo hookup in here. So you can put a two in one unit in here, but there is a hanging rod if you decide not to get that installed. Uh, combination units are great, guys. Keep in mind that if you are not taking the clothes out after the wash and wringing them out, it will take a much longer time to dry because that's what that unit is meant for. You are meant to take the wet clothes out, wring them out, and then put them back in to dry. So a lot of people complain my combo is not drying properly. Uh, try that next time or, you know, just wash them and then air dry them outside. You have got pretty deep drawers here. Go all the way back for some clothing, whatnot. Uh, moving into the master bedroom, you have a sliding door that's gonna close you off for complete privacy. You've got a second AC directly in the bedroom, which is really nice. Um, all of the cabinets above there for some storage over your bed. You've got power towers on each side of your bed. This is a nice feature here. Oh, it's a U. I'm sorry, it's a USB, thank you. USB, but also this is a wireless charger, so you can push it back in the counter and just put your phone on top of there, and depending on what kind of phone you have, it'll wires, wirelessly charge. Uh, emergency exit behind me, right, king bed, and then you have a his and hers closet. So super nice there. There's your ladder for the uh, bunk bed up top. And then um, little nightstand area here, and the TV is on a mount on gas struts, so that will lift up nicely, and you've got a private secure area here. Maybe you could install a safe back there for your valuables. And yeah, that is my 34G, the Vision XL. This is the new 2023 model from Integra. Um, like I said, super excited about the Hershey show coming up in two weeks. I believe we should have one of these heat there at the show. So come on down and see me for an awesome deal on your next adventure. Until next time, happy camping.